The Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs, Disaster Management and Social Development has promised to sustain the National Social Investment Programme. It said it will also improve um, its service delivery nationwide. Moyo Thomas reports. There had been speculations that the National Social Investment Programmes may be scrapped as it was removed from the Vice President's purview. These speculations have sent jitters down the spines of beneficiaries of the empowerment scheme who are mostly very financially vulnerable. The Minister of Humanitarian Affairs, Disaster Management and Social Development has laid the speculations to rest, assuring the program will be strengthened. She met with state focal persons and program managers to strategize and devise means of strengthening the NSIP value chain across the country. The minister says through the social investment and empowerment program, government has been able to lift 5 million Nigerians out of extreme poverty, in line with his agenda of lifting 100 million Nigerians out of poverty. Improve the NSIP service delivery nationwide. Two, share regional best practices and lessons learned within the states. Three, strategize on means of strengthening and sustaining the program. Four, devise strategies to strengthen the NSIP value chain. And five, improve the public and private sector support and participation. I'm hopeful that this strategic meeting will further enable the program managers, in this case, the state focal persons, to be more proactive and strategic in the delivery of this important program, most especially to the most vulnerable in the society. The National Social Investment Program is the NPAR program that provides young Nigerians with job training and education as well as a monthly stipend of 30,000 Naira. Moya Thomas, TVC News, Abuja.